New tonight, another setback for athletics in Alabama. As Way 31's Max Cohan reports, some college sports are delayed. It was sad news for sports fans all around northern Alabama tonight as the Southwestern Athletic Conference officially announced the postponement of all fall athletics, including football. If we play football in this fall and we had one death, it wouldn't be worth it to me. You know, if we had one person die from COVID because we're playing football, then we, it won't be worth it. Alabama A&M head coach Connell Maynard says he backs the Southwestern Athletic Conference's decision to postpone fall athletics. It's just too dangerous right now, and I think it's in the best interest of everybody. Uh, and I think it was a good decision. Under the SWAC's new plan, most fall sports would play a competitive schedule during the spring. Football teams would play a seven-game schedule, six games in conference, and the option for one non-conference game. Maynard says football players are used to making sacrifices and supports the plan because it benefits the fans. HBCUs, we have TV, but we don't have a lot of TV games. And so, therefore, they would be punished. They won't be able to come to the games. You know, now that we push back in, into the spring, they're going to probably be able to come to the games. And we have fans in the stands. No players really want to play without fans in the stands. So it's just a win-win situation for everybody, I think. Reporting in normal, Max Cohan, Way 31 News. Thanks, Max. The conference announced plans for other sports, including women's soccer and volleyball, along with both men's and women's cross-country. That information will be released at a later date.